All right. Thanks very much, you guys. Well, we have a Fox News alert to start with here. Fires and floods that are threatening two separate nuclear facilities on American soil. Screen left. Take a look. A wall of flames creeping dangerously close to the birthplace of the atomic bomb at the nuclear weapons and Re research facility in Los Alamos, New Mexico. Look at those flames. Then uh, let's go over to the other side of your screen there where you see a wall of water that now surrounds Fort Calhoun. And that is a nuclear reactor in Nebraska. Both of these situations, as you would imagine, are putting communities there very much on edge. So some double trouble this morning uh, as we get started here in America's Newsroom. Good to have you with us to, uh, today, everybody. I'm Martha McCall. And I'm Greg Jardine for Bill Hemmer. Frightening pictures yeah. we were looking at Indeed there. Local officials and the Nuclear Regulatory Commission saying there is absolutely no threat, though, to the public right now in either New Mexico or Nebraska. We have done those types of simulations in here where we lose all station power. The operators are trained for station blackout conditions and also emergency procedures such that they can keep the core cool. All right, so Steve Harrigan is standing by. Uh, let's uh, go over to him. He's in Fort Calhoun, Nebraska. That's about 20 miles from Omaha. 